Welcome back to CVTV. I'm Aaliyah. And I'm Alyssa. We, we are, are your CVTV CV anchors. We would like to wish Javier a very happy birthday. Don't forget to come to the office after CVTV for your birthday pencil. Don't forget that this week's riddle of the week is what starts with the letter T, is filled with the letter T, and ends in T. Good luck. Remember to turn all answers into the orange box in Mr. Tom's room. The winner and the answer will be announced Friday morning on WCVE Radio. Next we have today's joke of the day. Did you hear the joke about the peanut butter? No, what was it? I don't know. I mean, I'm not telling you. <laughs> I might, you might spread it. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. I've got one for you now. What kind of nuts always seem to have a cold? I don't know. What? Cashew. Bless you. <laughs> no, cashews. Oh, I get it. We would love to hear your joke in the day. Submit your jokes into the orange box located on the shelf in Mr. Tom's room. We look forward to putting your jokes on the air. Don't forget, Mrs. Stargell's class is selling 2014 calendars for only $12. Get your order, and this week, there will be lots of pictures of Crestview students. Next, we have Mrs. Brown's weekly message. Welcome back to CVTV, Ms. Brown. Hi, girls. Hey, that's a tough riddle this week. I have to keep thinking on that one. My friends, I just want to remind you of three safe choices you always have. If you see a classmate or a friend make a mistake, you have to make a choice and I want it to be one of these three. If they make a mistake, you can ignore their mistake. You could get away from the situation or you could get help. All three of those choices are safe choices because it means you don't double the trouble. It means one person's made a mistake not two. So Crestview students, I need you to be smart and when you have to make a choice, make a safe one. Ignore, get away, or get help if needed. Thanks. Make it a great rest of the day. Back to you girls. Next we have today in history. On this day in 1964, the Reverend Martin Luther King became a recipient of the Nobel Prize for Peace. He was the youngest person to have won the award. Our dog today comes from computer programmer and Microsoft owner Bill Gates. He says it's fine to celebrate success, but it's more important it's heed in the lessons of fluor. Thank you for listening. I'm Leah. And I'm Elizabeth. Have a great Tuesday. Take care of yourself. And, and stay, stay responsible, responsible, respectful, and safe.